It is that time of year. The streets of Old Louisville once again filled with thousands of people for the annual St. James Court Art Show. W. Derby's Grace Haber is in the middle of all the people and art. Grace. Valerie Gilbert, it's been two years since people were able to walk the streets here in Old Louisville for the St. James Court Art Show. And today, as the event kicked off, it was clear that the people and the artists are just happy to be back. <laughs> Coming back is kind of like seeing old friends that we probably haven't seen for a while. Beside the trees and old Victorian homes, tent after tent once again cover old Louisville in a blanket of white. I bought me a nice tie. Over 600 artists are taking part in the 65th annual St. James Court Art Show. We got so excited with this year and I was I got kind of nervous because I was thinking they might cancel last minute, but you know, I'm glad it, they went through and organized it. The show features both local and international artists. And it's certainly a homecoming for us seeing as many different artists come to show their individual artistic talents. Artists like Noel Skiba. <laughs> yeah. I paint live all over the country and all over the world. And Aisha Nadal. I wanted to do something that will touch back my community back home in Senegal. Nadal so has lived in Louisville for 18 years. This is a tradition that we all grew up knowing how to do. Selling handmade sweet grass baskets that she and other women make in the African village where she grew up. And the proceeds go back to help them. I can layer it or do more minimal. On the same street. I just find it so um, more freeing. You know, it's like, it's like a, I never grew up. Is where you'll find you Skiba, the Florida native who travels the world doing finger painting, making stops each year in Louisville for the art show and the Kentucky Derby. My mom said I started uh, finger painting when I was two, so I'm a fifth generation artist, so I've never stopped. I'm glad to be here today painting. Capturing the smiles. Kind of capturing the energy. Capturing the joy. The energy from all the people. We love the people. Capturing an event that is more than just art in Louisville. Rain or shine, the events here start at 10 a.m. Um, both Saturday and Sunday, and the event will end Sunday at 5. Reporting live in Old Louisville, Grace Haber, WDRB News. Grace, thank you.